everybody, my name is Python and welcome back to another episode of my new Minecraft Survival Let's Play. We're on the third episode, guys, and once again, I just can't get over how much support you guys have been showing this new series lately. I, I can't believe it. I honestly can't. We hit quarter of a million subscribers, which is insane. <laughs> and there's been a lot of new faces lately. So a big warm welcome to all of you guys who are new to the channel. And of course, a massive thank you to all of you guys who have stuck with me for a fair while. Now, in the last episode, we reached, again, well over 10,000 likes. So if we can keep it up with, let's say, again, half that 5,000, that will be enough to tell me that you guys want to keep seeing more. And also, in terms of the fan art, there's been such an incredible influx of fan art coming lately. I think what I'm going to do is like showcase five bits of fan art in the uh, bottom left like I did in the last episode And then yeah, even when the series maybe dies down a little bit later down the line uh, Then yeah, we've still got some fan art to go through as we go along So in today's episode my friends the name of the game is diamonds We're going to be showing you how and where to find diamonds diamonds because nowadays you don't necessarily have to go and mine it you can find it quite easily in things like uh, little shipwrecks underwater you can find them all over the place you really really can so yeah i'm excited guys i really really am so one of the other more fun things i want to do is i want to tame a dog because in the first episode we came across quite a lot of dogs so it would be nice to get a dog. So, we're going to make ourselves an iron pickaxe because, yes, we're going to be hopefully doing a bit of mining in today's episode. And I tell you what, we'll leave the other iron ingot for spare. Uh huh, seems like a good idea. We've got the bones there. Uh, we're going to make ourselves a few replacement tools and weapons. Uh, so, let's grab ourselves maybe a replacement sword here. And we'll do a couple pickaxes because I feel like we're going to just like dig ourselves a bit of a tunnel going down to the necessary level to find diamonds. So, yeah, guys, going to be a fantastic time. Got ourselves a shield, got ourselves food. I think we're looking pretty good, guys. So, like I say, first thing I want to do is I want to grab a dog. That is right, my friends. I'm going to grab myself a little diggy doggy doggy. It's going to be a fantastic time. So, let's get over here and let's try and find ourselves one of them uh, Sven Wolf things. Those of you guys who watch PewDiePie, you know exactly what I'm on about. You do. You do. You know what I'm on about. All right. So, Mr. Wolf, where are you at? Oh, I can see one down there. Aha! I knew they weren't far away. I really did. So, hopefully, this guy will take no more than four bones to tame. Come on, buddy. Come on. One, two. Yay! I'm gonna call you Ollie. I'm gonna name you after one of my real-life dogs. Come on, buddy. Come on, Ollie. Uh, do you know what? I'm gonna keep a red collar on you as well. You know, we've got to have ourselves like an OG wolf, right? So, we've got Spike and we've got Ollie. Cool. All right, so we could take the dog down with us. That'd be pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, guys, like I say, today's going to be a fun episode. Hopefully, we're going to find ourselves diamonds and various other goodies. So yes, okay. I think a cool idea might be to just start randomly digging a bit of a mineshaft kind of dealio. So maybe we just dig down rather like this. Now, if we bring up our F3 screen on Java Edition, we are looking at the second chunk of text on the left there, specifically the line that says, says X, Y, Z. We need to go where that middle number says 11. It currently says 59. As we go down, the number gets less and less. We need to go down to number 11, okay? That is statistically where you will find uh, the most amount of diamonds. So, yeah, should be a pretty good time. Obviously, it'll be kind of awesome if we can find ourselves some cave systems as we go down. But for now, my friends, all we're going to do is we're just going to keep chopping down this stone. Oh, yeah. Chippity chip. Chip chop. Oh, yes. Gonna be a fantastic time. So, let's go down. Let's go down to Y11, and let's see if my theory is correct, and we find ourselves some of those beautiful blue shiny rocks. Alrighty, guys. So, we have indeed bumped into a little bit of a cave. So, let's have a little bit of a roam around. Come on. Come on, Ollie. Let's go have a little bit of a roll around. To be honest, I actually legitimately almost called him Sven, because I've been watching PewDiePie's Let's Play so much lately. <laughs> Ah, oh, freaking love that dude. Anyways, guys, let's have ourselves... Oh, a little bit of iron. I mean, I'm down with this. I'm definitely down with getting some iron because then hopefully we can get ourselves some more armor. Maybe even a full armor set. Uh, I hear multiple skeletons. Is there like a dungeon nearby? That'd be kind of cool. I won't lie. Come on, buddy. Let's have a little bit of a roam around. Uh, maybe they're down here. Kind of sounds like they might be. I don't know. I'm a little bit scared. 
I don't want to come across them and then they kill freaking Ollie. That would be really, really terrible. You know, getting a dog and it dying on your same episode. That's not cool, is it? Uh-huh. I mean, there's plenty of coal around here. I'll certainly use my stone pickaxe on this stuff. I don't want to use my iron pickaxe on this because I'm trying to save that for when we mine the more valuable ores. So things like redstone, lapis, gold, diamonds, maybe even emeralds if we ever go mining in an extreme hills biome because that's where you find emerald ore. So yeah, should be a good time. But for now, my friends, we're just going to dig ourselves this coal out here. We're not going to dig too, too much at this particular moment because like I say, the name of the game is diamonds today. So we're going to grab this and we're gonna hopefully find our way down the cave to diamond level what are we at now 47 so yeah we've still got a fair way to go uh so yeah off we go mate i really don't like the fact i'm hearing multiple skeletons like that's actually kind of freaking me out a little bit <laughs> i don't want to come across those guys i really don't okay right what do we got around here oh this appears to go down okay okay i can work with this I can work with it. All right, we got a little bit more iron. Definitely going to need that if we want ourselves some armor, like I say. Got ourselves a chest plate already, which is a good start. So, yeah. Come on, my friendo. My pickaxe is doing all the work, my friends. Oh, yes, it is. It's a good time. Oh, okay. Even more iron. Jeez. Is this vein ever going to end? Oh, my gosh. All right, let's keep ourselves going, huh? All right, so we're at a dead end here. So level 31 here appears to be the lowest level. So maybe we just sort of dig down again. Try to go down to Y equals 11. Sounds like a good idea to me. So I tell you what, let's do just a little bit of a jump cut here until we get to Y11. And then hopefully we can find ourselves a decent cave system with a bunch of goodies. All right, folks, I can hear lava very, very faintly. So you must be getting down to the right level. Look at that. We're at 16 now. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely hearing lava. So there's one thing I wanted to mention real quick, and that is the fact that, yes, this is locked on hard difficulty. On the first episode, there was a bit of a visual glitch, which made it look like a locked on normal difficulty, but I actually didn't. I think it was because I did it just a little bit too quick for Minecraft to keep up with. But, uh, yeah, it is definitely on hard difficulty, my friend friends you saw it right there so don't you guys worry about that all as well and guys check it out we've already got ourselves some beautiful redstone oh yeah something i actually do want to try and get into in this series is redstone because i don't really feel like i have tried too much to get into redstone honestly so yeah be kind of cool to see if we could uh, get some cool stuff going on you know what i'm saying so here we go my friends we're now at y equals 11 and what we're gonna do is what i call uh, branch mining so what we're going to do very, very simply is we are going to dig until... Wow! Okay! That's... <laughs> wow! Okay! Oh my goodness me! Jeez, man! Could we get any luckier in the series? So on the first episode, we found iron literally after starting to mine like two blocks. And now we've already got ourselves some freaking diamonds, my friends. What the heck is going on? <laughs> wow. That is so cool. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to, I'm going to, you know, you know, dig the surroundings of this thing. And then I'm going to take a little screeny because, you know, we're going to have diamonds as the freaking thumbnail today, don't we? Huh? Hey, little lolly. I mean, that's pretty awesome, isn't it? Oh, there's lapis down there as well. And you guys may notice that the lapis texture actually falls in line with the rest of the ores. That is once again, thanks to Izuma Void's Vanilla Tweaks resource pack picker thing. So once again, there will be a link to the resource pack and Izuma Void's Vanilla Tweaks website in the description down below. But there we go, my friends. Oh, come on, man. That is just awesome awesome hell yeah don't mind if i do okay so fun fact you can actually dig up lapis with a stone pickaxe and it will still give you the freaking drops so that's kind of cool right huh that's pretty awesome uh, there's some more down here obviously we need lapis if we want to enchant or dye anything blue so yeah cool all right guys let's do this one two three and a four that's a pretty good start the perfect amount of diamonds in my opinion to get is seven or minimum five so five if you want to make yourself a diamond pickaxe and an enchant table or seven if you want to make yourself a diamond pickaxe a diamond sword and then also an enchantment table so if we could potentially find ourselves maybe three more diamonds i would be 
very, very happy to call today's episode a total success. I mean, to be honest with you, if you don't class what I've already got, you know, already a total success, then I don't even know what's going on. I mean, it's not very often I'll find diamonds that quick. <laughs> it really, really isn't. It really, really isn't. So, here's my method. So, dig forward four blocks rather than like this. So, there you go. Four, one, two, three... Four, then we place down a torch so no enemies can spawn down the little branch mines. And then you dig until you until you can't reach any further. So that's five blocks. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so same on this side. And basically, this is the typical way that I do my resource mining in a Minecraft world. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Obviously, finding a cave system would be kind of nice because then we could maybe find some other epic stuff so like lava. Uh, but yeah, I don't know, man. I kind of want to try and go for a cave system. I won't lie. Okay, so I'm hearing zombies. I wouldn't mind trying to be able to find them, you know? So where do we think they're going to be, huh? Were they like... Okay, I'm hearing lava. So maybe we need to go over in this direction a little bit. I don't know, man. I'm trying to, like, listen out for where they may be. I'm definitely hearing lava, though. Where's the lava? Have I moved away from it? I think I've moved away from it. Hmm. I'll tell you what. I am going to set down a crafting table. I'm going to make myself some more stone pickaxes so I don't, like, use my good iron one. I mean, strictly speaking, I could. Do you know what? I will. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to smell all of this iron while we're down here. I just feel like that's a good use of our time. So, boom, boom. Half that, and then chuck that in there. There we go. A little bit of double action smelting. You gotta love it, my friends. You do. Okay, so, where is this lava? We've gotta find it, Ollie. We've gotta find it. Where is it? There we go, my friends. I think I'm pretty confident in saying we can upgrade ourselves to an iron pickaxe and not really worry about it anymore. So, I think the rest of this iron I'm gonna use for armor. And then I think we'll be okay. So, come on. Where was that lava? Hmm? I hear it nearby. I do. I hear it nearby. It's got to be somewhere around it. I'm going to find it. I am. Oh, I heard water there. Oh, there's redstone as well. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. There's got to be a cave around here. There simply has to be. There's like, there's like too many things going on around me. There's like water. There's lava. You got to be here somewhere. Come on. Come on. Present yourself to me. Do it. Ah, nice little bit of gold for the repertoire. Don't mind if I do, my friends. So gold is pretty useful for, uh, you know, golden apples. And the reason you want golden apples is because you can uh, cure zombie villagers. And if you cure a zombie villager, you will typically get a lot better trades uh, or much more discounted trades, more to the point, than if you didn't do that. So, yeah. Oh, look at that. Even more. Oh, you're gonna love it, my friends. We seem to have a little bit of an ore hotspot here, which is kind of nice. I'll be honest. It's kind of nice. So, don't mind if I do. Look at all this. Look. Look. Ollie's getting excited for the gold. Are you are you, like, attracted to gold there, my sir? Hmm? Is that what you're doing? Hmm? Alright. Come on, buddy. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's have you... Let's maybe... Uh, hello? Buddy, come over here. Come on. There you go. Right, I'll tell you what. You can sit down like here next to the utility area. Aha. Coolio. Right, so we've already got a chest plate. Let's make ourselves some boots, a helmet, and some trousers, and then boom, boom, boom. Yeah. We good, guys. We're good. Okay, seven more bits. We can make ourselves a, uh, a sword and maybe a shovel if we wanted to. Uh-huh. All right. We are making the full upgrade, huh? Yeah. This is kind of epic. Look at that. Fully upgraded, my friends. Iron tools. We're looking good. So, come on. We're going to find that cave system. It's going to happen. Aha! I think I've just bumped into something. Okay. Uh, We've got a little bit of water going on. Ah, there we go, my friends. We've got ourselves an actual cave system. Right, now then. If we can find ourselves just a tiny smidge more diamonds, I'm going to be very happy. Oh, yeah. Well, there's plenty of redstone around here. That's pretty cool. Okay, okay, I can work with it. Give me a little bit of that. Thank you very much indeed, my good sir. There's a little bit more redstone down here too. Ah, yes. Give me. Give me all the things. Thank you very much. You never know what ores may be connected to other ores, so I would usually suggest actually going ahead and making the effort to, uh, you know, mine up ores. 
because you never know what you might find. You really, really never know. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyways, guys, we're doing pretty well so far. We've got a pretty substantial amount of iron. We've got armor already. We've got ourselves iron tools. So, honestly, at this point, I would literally just like to find the diamonds. So, if we could just keep ourselves up with the luck that we've got going on, then that, my friendos, would be very, very nice. So, I'm going to put down a torch in there. And, hmm. Okay, so that sort of goes over that way. There doesn't appear to be any other cave systems coming off of this. A little bit disappointing, I'll be honest, but... Oh, well. Doesn't matter too much. Let's obsidianize that. There we go. Cool. Right. Hmm. There's got to be some more stuff around here somewhere, man. Come on. I tell you what, I'm just going to keep digging until I find something. Ah! Okay, so we're back at that original lava pool that we found. And I just started to sort of dig a little bit of a pathway beside it. And it turns out that... No! <laughs> this gravel was, like, uh, blocking the way, but it all sort of cascaded. And now, we have some diamondos. Okay, so, if we have three, that's the magic number we're looking for, okay? Three is the magic number. Now, let's go ahead and do, you know, a big brain thing here. Uh, do a little bit of that, okay? Uh, block that off as well. Right, if we have three here, I'm going to be happy. Okay, so, one two. Ah, oh, it's just two. Ah, oh, man, if we had one more diamond, I would literally class, you know, this whole trip as being, like, a total success by every stretch of the imagination. Ah, dang, blast it. Okay. Well, maybe we can get lucky. This appears to go sort of all over the place, really. There may, just may, be some more diamonds sort of dotted around the place. That would be very nice, I won't lie. It would be very, very nice. Uh-huh. Plenty of stuff going on around here. Oh, whoa. I heard skellies. I don't want to get on the wrong side of them. All right, what's going on over there? Ooh, hey. This looks, this looks kind of cool. Okay, so there's still lava behind that. So I might actually put a torch in there as a little bit of a signifier. Just in case we need the lava later on. I mean, you never know, man. You never know when you might need lava. So there's gold over there. Dude, we've got ourselves a proper cave here now. That's kind of cool. Oh, right, I got some more gold. Okay. Kill all the things. Good day to you, gentlemen. Come on, then. Come on. Come on. Oh, my gosh. You took a lot of hits, huh? All right. There's... Oh. Creeper Brothers. Ah, yeah. I got to love me a shield. Shields are awesome. Oh, God. Hello. Hello. There's plenty of dudes coming after this freaking cave, huh? Ah, oh, mate. I mean, it's not that valuable, is it? I mean, not unless there's like 563,000 diamonds around here. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but that would be quite an epic find. Uh, what's around this corner, huh? It's always worth checking what's around a lava pool. You just never know. You just never know. All right, so that's like connected to lava. I don't think I'm going to get on the wrong side of that. I'll be honest with you guys. Boom, boom. Uh, I mean, not unless I do that. Yeah. Ha! Again, big brain. I'm so smart. Anyways, boom. Come on, man. There's got to be some more diamonds around here. Like, every single diamond sense of mine is tingling right now. There's got to be some. I just know it. There's got to be some. Oh, there they are. Okay, so the original cave sort of came out here. As you oh, God. Hello. Oh, goodness me. Okay. Oh, you're dead. Uh, there's, like, multiple zombies around. I'm a little bit scared. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Oh, please cease and desist with that. Hello. Oh, gosh. Yeah, this is uh, this is a little bit dangerous, man. All right, I think we should get this stuff and get the heck... Oh, God. Okay, so there's, like, zombies everywhere. They're coming after your diamonds, huh? Are you trying to guard them? Hmm, you're doing a pretty poor job of it. I mean, I did just kill you. All right, so... One, two, three. All right, we're good. Oh, oh God. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. They're coming after it. They're a little bit mad that I stole their diamonds. Hey, ma'am, they're my diamonds now. They're mine. I deserve them. And they now belong to me. So goodbye and all that kind of stuff. Oh, look at all these guys down here. You know what? I'm not going to tempt fate. I'm going to go home. I think I'm just about good here, man. <laughs> I don't want to tempt fate. I just don't. Wait. Oh, uh, yeah. We've still got freaking Ollie way back at the way back at the little utility area we made. We should probably try to get back there and pick him up, huh? <laughs> oh, no. Otherwise, my like to dislike ratio will just go down the chute. I don't want that to happen, man. I just don't. Oh, my goodness me. Look at all this stuff, man. There's so much. Oh. There we go. In fact, you know what? I think that's a pretty good point to end this little session here. So, uh, we're going back this way. And then, 
We've got the little area coming off here. And then we go over this way. Uh-huh. And there's the dog. Awesome. All right. I think we're good. All right, Ollie. Come on, then. We're good here. We're done. We're done. Okay? We are done for this episode's worth of diamond mining. Oh yeah. Those scary sounds don't scare me. Not anymore. I've got everything I need. I'm feeling pretty freaking cool, man. All right. So, what we got to do is get out. Get out. Uh, hopefully, it's not too difficult. Huh? I mean, I feel like we're halfway out already. Where's the rest of it? There it is. Yeah. All right. We can come out of this with our heads held high, ladies and gentlemen. We are the first diamonds of the series, and I am feeling pretty darn good about it. Come on, Ollie. Let's introduce you to Spike, and hopefully you don't hate each other, because if you do, then I'm going to be a little bit sad. I like it when everybody's, like, happy with each other and stuff. Come on, then. Let's get you inside the house, and then we'll do the comments question of the video and probably end off the episode. A rousing success, if I do say so myself. Always nice to have a, a successful episode as opposed to an episode full of fail. You know what I'm saying? And also, look at that. The sun's about to go down as well. So, you know, perfect timing and all that. Come on, then, little broski. There you go. In you come. In you come, little mate. Right, in you go. There you go. Right, we've got to close that. Close that. And get you inside of here. Cool. Right. I want you to sit next to the cat. There you go. Are you going to, like, come over this way? Get off those chests, man. I need to use those things, dude. Buddy. Buddy. Ollie. What are you doing, man? You going to come down? You going to come down from there? Can I, like... Uh, this, isn't, this isn't working. Do you know what? Okay, you can sit up there. I can still access the chest, so I don't think it really matters too much. Oh my goodness me, my inventory is just completely dead. There's so much stuff, man. Oh my goodness me. Uh, look at all the blocks we got. Oh my word, that's cool. Look at all the cobblestone. We can use that for building, man. That is epic. So, there we go, my friends. A nice day's worth of mining. Got nine diamonds. A pretty good start. If you ask me, we can make ourselves an enchant table, a diamond sword, a diamond pickaxe, maybe even a jukebox if we really wanted. So, today's comment question of the video comes from Alex Elwood, who says, Love the series. Can you give us the seed on the 25th or 50th episode? Because I really want to copy your base. Lots of love from Australia. Hey, man, I appreciate the kind words and, of course, the comments as well. Well, now in terms of the seed, I did mention on the first episode that I'm keeping the seed private for now. The reason being is because I don't really want people to be spoiling whatever it is I may have in this world. So, basically guys, whenever I decide to do the first map download, whenever that may be, I haven't really decided yet, uh, then yeah, upon that point, yeah, the seed will be out there anyway because it will be part of the world, right? So, yeah, basically guys, once I decide to do my first map download, that will be when the seed is released. But for now, my friends, Friends. I'm keeping this world for myself just now so I can keep everything a surprise to myself. So, yeah, guys, I think that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. Like I say, a nice, successful episode. Plenty of diamonds, plenty of goodies. So if you guys have enjoyed today's episode, as always, a like rating would be very much appreciated. It goes a long, long way. It truly does. It helps out myself, the channel, and the video very, very much. Hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ding that bell so you guys don't miss out on future content. But for now, my friends, it is time for me to bid you farewell go to sleep and say goodbye to you so guys thank you very much for watching have a fantastic rest of your day and i'll see you guys in the next episode